Good morning and welcome to this morning's webinar as part of our National Apprenticeship Week series of events. Um, this morning we will be looking at what apprenticeships are available and what are the hot sectors right now. My name is Ben Pountney and I'm the Operational Manager for Apprenticeships and Employer Engagement at South Devon College. A very warm welcome this morning, I hope you're well. So first and foremost, um, what is an apprenticeship? An apprenticeship is a job that has substantial training and development of transferable skills. It's an opportunity for people of all ages to earn while they learn, gaining real skills and knowledge for a successful future. So what we're looking at this morning is why would you want to do an apprenticeship in 2021? There's never been a better time to, to be an apprentice. The government really have got behind apprenticeships and they do see them as a key element to the economy recovering from the effects of the COVID-19 pandemic that we're still part of. There's been a recent survey in a number of employers that believe that work-based learning, so apprenticeships that are going to be vital to the recovery, has actually got jumped up from 50% to 70%. So employers are really seeing the benefits of employing apprentices as we move forward through the pandemic. And since the arrival of vaccines, the number of businesses planning to take on an apprentice has actually jumped up from 60% to 70%. So it's a really exciting time to consider being an apprentice. Rishi Sunak, the Chancellor of the Exchequer, um, who you've probably seen on the news recently, has recently said that 91% of apprentices stay in work or complete further training after their course. We really know they work. So we've got some really big players that really believe in apprenticeships. So it really is a great time to consider being an apprentice. We're committed to supporting more people into work. This is the government. They really want employers uh, to take on apprentices. They're offering incentives to employers at this moment in time to take you on uh, as an apprentice. They can actually earn up to £2,000 for taking on a 16 to 24 year old as an apprentice. So it's a really good opportunity for employers, um, which all plays into the hands of people looking for an apprenticeship as well. The government have recently told us that 700,000 young people will be leaving education this year, and it's the young people that have been hit really hard by coronavirus. Under 25s are two and a half times more likely to work in a sector that's been most impacted by the coronavirus, like retail and hospitality. But out of this, we also see opportunity. As we start to recover from the effects of the ongoing pandemic, we really believe that these industries will see some boom um, and we'll really see some growth, particularly in Torbay, as the hospitality is a huge, huge part of our local economy. So in terms of what apprenticeships you can do and what are available, Believe it or not, there are currently over 700 different apprenticeship standards available across all sectors. That's an awful lot. There have been some traditional views that you could only do an apprenticeship in things like hair and beauty or, or construction, but these have really, really changed. You can do an apprenticeship now in almost anything. So on the right hand side of the page here, you can see the apprenticeship levels. So apprenticeships aren't just at entry level now. You can also do an apprenticeship right up to a degree level. So they start at a level two and work all the way through to level seven apprenticeships. So here we've got a table which contains some examples of apprenticeships you could do in Torbay and Devon. These are all available at South Devon College, but I hasten to add that you can do apprenticeships through a variety of training providers. And I'd encourage you if you're considering doing an apprenticeship to approach several at least and really see what's available to you and what options are open to you. So healthcare assistant practitioner, healthcare support worker, adult care worker, these are all real growth sectors that we're seeing and we expect to continue to see growth in these areas. The healthcare service, as we know, are under huge pressure at the minute and they're very much looking to take on um, and develop skilled individuals to continue the good work. These courses can last anywhere between 18 and 24 months. Again, you'll be working very much in the job but you'll be spending time outside of that at college learning the skills that you need to complete your job. Bricklayer, carpentry and joinery site carpenters, quantity surveyor technicians, these are again are real growth sectors. So you only have to look around you in Torbay at the moment to see that there's lots of ongoing building work and these building sites need more skilled workers. We need to develop the people that we have in the area into these opportunities. Again, these courses vary between or these apprenticeships sorry vary between 18 and 30 months 36 months maintenance and operating operations engineering boat building marine again huge growth opportunities in these sectors as well 
we are surrounded by water down here in Devon um, and the marine sector is, is ever growing. Also our professional services sector, so business administration, assistant accountants and the digital sector are all growth sectors. These are all areas that you may wish to consider doing an apprenticeship in and we'd be delighted to tell you more about them if you're interested in doing so. So I've summarised here for you the sectors that are hot right now. These are the sectors that we really anticipate as we move away from the COVID-19 pandemic growing and continuing to grow. The construction industry, the healthcare and social work industry, as we know, are under huge pressure at the moment and really, really will continue to see growth. Engineering and manufacturing, particularly as we move through Brexit as well, we see growth in these areas. The marine sector, South Devon College has got some exciting stuff going on down at NOS at the moment in terms of our marine academy and we see growth in this area too, as does the government. The professional services sector and the hospitality sector, as we've just touched upon, they're facing some real challenges at this moment in time, but we see these being key to the success and the growth of our economy as we move away from the pandemic. And this will present some fantastic opportunities for apprentices to go and work in these areas. So I think that concludes most of what we've got to talk about this morning, but I've just signposted a few bits on the end here. If you can go away and have a look for more information if you so desire. So the government website listed here at the top, that will have all vacancies that are available in apprenticeships at this moment in time. And equally, the second link down here is the South Devon website, the South Devon College website, which has all of our vacancies listed too. If you would require any more information or you want some help or want to ask us anything apprenticeship related, then please do email us at apprenticeships at southdevon.ac.uk. So I have got an opportunity now to just see if there have been any questions. So I'm just going to stop sharing the presentation for a moment and just double check to see if we've had any questions. So no, I don't think we've had any questions. So thank you very much for your time this morning. Thanks for listening. As I said, if there is anything at all that you'd like help with apprenticeship wise, please do get in contact. We'd love to help you. Stay safe and take care. Thank you very much.